Hi, my name is Diego Rangel, and today I will be talking about the topic that really seems to be getting America's attention, racism. Slavery was a term that was used in the 20th century, but not slavery is called racism. I say that because many colored people are still getting killed on the street with the killers being white and not getting any fair punishment for their actions. The only possible punishment they could receive is mental madness. Police officers seem to be the ones doing the most damage and the ones doing the most racism acts. For example, take the death of Floyd Royce, who was an African-American that I believe didn't pay his parking ticket and the police officer, which was a white male, put his knees on his neck and removed them after he couldn't breathe. This really seemed to impact the colored community because riots started to form all over America. And I honestly believe that this really impacted us because this just shows that we are not united at all. I remember seeing the video of George Floyd's death on my Instagram feed. And I remember George Floyd saying, I can't breathe various of times and the officer still didn't raise his feet. I mean his knee. I just believe that it's unfair for people to run in cruelty like that and not get any punishment for their actions. It's really upsetting what America has become. We are not united at all. I've never told anyone this, but sometimes when I go out in public and I am in a white people area, I sort of feel ashamed of the color of my skin. I feel that I will be judged and probably not get, be treated equally, honestly, and it just terrifies me that I could be in a position like George Floyd or anyone else that's colored. And that's why America needs to step up and fix this racism behavior because that is just cruel for people to get killed on the street like if we were animals because that's the way we're being treated, like animals. And that's not really fair. Um, like I had said in my previous speech, I do like watching Netflix a lot. And most of the shows are about teenagers and drama and stuff like that. And they do involve um, racism acts. Like there's, there's some, there's a TV show called 13 Reasons Why. In the third season, I believe it shows that a white kid and a black kid were fighting and that the police officer only detained the black um the black kid because why because of the color of his skin and it just caused a caused a huge fight in the school because they found it unfair that the white boy and didn't get arrested but the black boy did and obviously we've all heard the book um we've all seen books about racism and movies and it just really terrifies me because that's not a movie that is real life and that is what really is happening and i just believe that that we should stop doing doing what we should stop being racist like racist is overrated like honestly that is 19th century 20th century things that we shouldn't be doing and overall all of us are the same it doesn't matter of the color of our skins, we should not be judged by it because we are all unique. And I believe that if we, if racism didn't exist, America would be more advanced and possibly even one of the best countries in the globe. Thanks for listening, Diego Runhill.